Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie here, and I'm back with Persona 3 Portable. That's right, everyone's favorite JRPG that isn't Toast? Yes, he doesn't like the PS3, B, the PS3, PSP version. Anyway, we're back after a very long hiatus because I got busy with other stuff. But I'm back, and we're gonna play some Persona 3. Uh, as always, I have to always start these videos off this way. Not a lot of people watch my Persona videos. So for the seven people out there who like watching this, I really, it really helps me, it helps me feel motivated if I see a like, so please leave a like if you like the video. Comment with me too if you've got something to say, I guess. There's definitely people who have something to say, you know? Uh, I'm tired. Last time we left off, I was tired. I'm pretty sure that's, that's what happened. Um, here's the other thing I remember. This is still on the hardest difficulty in the damn game. Um, so that's great. Good morning. Have you... How did you sound like Mitsuru? Good morning. Have you accumulated to your school yet? Yes. I see. Your ability to adapt to new situations and environments is very impressive. By the way, there's something I forgot to tell you. Most times you can find me in the lounge. However, I won't be there if there is something I must attend to. So if I'm not in the lounge, we will, we will explore Tartarus the following day. Okay. Fair enough. It's finally time for lunch. Give me foods. Yo, kind of feel weird running into you in the hall like that. We get we go to the same school, dude. Oh hey, you free today? Want to go see a movie? I don't know yet. A movie, huh? I don't know yet. I see. Well, if you're free, let's go. Let me know after school. Seems that Junpei doesn't have much to do after school. Typical Junpei. During your break, people will tell me, yeah. Really? Junpei's the only one that wants to hang out with me? No. Okay. Okay, before we hang out, let me see if I have any magician persona. I do. Guess who we're hanging out with today? That's right, Junpei. Shout out to the person who guessed it before I can say anything. Oh, I can't save here. That's right. I think I'm playing a modern video game and not a PSP game. Hey, are you on your way home? It seems Junpei wants to talk about the dorm with you. Do I have an Ekamata? Alright, I'll win. Oh really? Then let's stop by somewhere. Junpei seems happy. Tatsumi Port Island Station Movie Theater. Junpei insists that you come see a movie with him. This is it. Double Barrel Justice. I've been looking forward to this coming out. Junpei's eyes are lit up. Come on, let's get in. Let's go in. Ooh, are you looking forward to it too? All right, let's get some good seats. Junpei is jittery as if he can't wait to go on. You and Junpei have watched the movie Double Barrel Justice together. Seeing the action scenes on the big screen was overwhelming. The story was surprisingly complex. It was kind of not what I was expecting. Junpei cocks his head. The villain wasn't all that evil. He kind of killed it for me when he started talking about his tragic past. <laughs> Junpei, you are a simpleton. I mean, this isn't cool if you have to beat somebody who you didn't want to be a bad guy. Bad guy should be evil all the way to the core. That's more satisfying. Me and Junpei have the same thing. What Junpei looks for in a villain is what I look for in a good wrestler. Junpei shrugs. Oh, you still got time, right? Let's grab something to eat on the way back. Look at that. Freaking duck. I was about to say the F word. The F U C the other ones. Ah oh, crap, the guys at school might see some stuff if they see us together. I mean it looks like there's a lot of guys interested in you. Oh thank you. I I forgot that I'm a woman in this game. Plus the famous Yukatan and Mitsuru Senpai live in the same dorm too. There are a lot of dudes who envy me because of that. Let them be jealous. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, it's not like any of it. This is my fault. Junpei laughs. Actually, you don't seem to be all that interested in guys. Unfortunately, if I could be with women, I would be. I mean, you're not all excited asking me who was saying all this stuff. I mean, of course you aren't. No girl would be that desperate. Junpei nods triumphantly. Oh, so no, you got you probably got to your hands full with your own stuff too. Now. Actually, the same goes for me too. Junpei's expression suddenly turns serious. I feel like you understand Junpei a little better now. 
duck, man. That duck staring into my soul. Duck. Well, forget about that stuff. Want more fries? You don't mind sharing with me, right? You and Junpei chatted for a while before heading back. Welcome back. Oh, thank you. For your information, the internet line which was ripped apart. Okay, sweet. Alright. All this talk about the internet reminded me of something. I was totally addicted to this one online game for a while. It's called Innocent Sin Online, and it's pretty fun. I haven't touched it since I got here. Maybe I should log in sometime. If the plan is to use everything we're gonna have to win, then that's what we're gonna have to do. We'll use the most effective attacks to defeat the enemy, and we won't be concerned with our own SP and health. If you sense some danger, it'd be nice if you could change your plan immediately or heal us. Since tomorrow is a holiday, I think I'll play Innocent Sin online. How are you exploring of Tartar's proceeding? Really good. Excellent. Then continue the good work. What do you got to say? Yes, how can I help you? Doc. There are three vengeance is knocking out. Okay. We all know this. Stop treating me like a child. You know, it's pretty hard to heal you when you get sick. For example, Dia is only half as effective on you. So try not to get sick, okay? I can't help it, man. That's my face, sir. Okay. Ah! No. Yes. Ah, oh, this theme's so good. Personas! You can't fuse anything. I'm out of here. I forget that I don't have access to the book till much later. Let's see. How's my equipment looking? Can I go in here right now? Can I talk to the police? I don't have much time. You should be able to find what you need. I've got some new things. Take a look. Even for sale. See what we got here. Really, nothing. I want to sell the hard joker. Man, are you kidding me with these prices? Six thousand dollars for no, it's six thousand two hundred yen for some pair of leather boots. Shit's expensive, man. Who the hell do you think I am? So not even that much more defense, really. Mm. Yeah, I just think I'm, I'm not gonna get any of this dog. Are you kidding me? Okay. So. Vamp loafers. I mean, in theory, I could really. I just don't know, man. It's Triesto Jump. That's really good. So no, I'm not selling that. Really? I thought that was... Never mind. I'm thinking of Go Home from Persona 4. Okay. Escapade. Hmm, mm, I feel a strange aura around you. In my mind, I see visions, people's past, presence, and future. For most people, I see clearly and far ahead. But you are different. Your future is filled with both blinding light and stagnant shadow. I can see, but a small portion of what lies beyond that is shrouded in mystery. What a peculiar fate you carry. Now, young lady, bearer of light and shadow, if you wish to know more about in the near future, come and talk to me. I shall share my limited visions with you. Now tell me, what would you like to know of your fortune? Yes, please. Very well. You have pulled fate's trigger. The bullet passes through many, heading directly to its target. What target that may be, however, is unknown to me. You must find that out for yourself. Farewell, then. May your futures be bright. Thanks, Lee. I have known that girl since we were in elementary school together. She loves fortune-telling stuff. She used to pull out these weird props from her bag. 
She claimed they were like her lucky charms. Ugh. Do you believe in fortune telling in a young girl's soul? Yeah, so you do too. I don't mean to say it comes true all the time, but sometimes. Do you need something? Oh, are you looking for company? Sorry, but you'll have to take a number. I already have so many chickies waiting for me. Just wait your turn like any other day, okay? Bro, you are in the middle of a damn nightclub with your hands folded. You're nothing. This guy's got more chicks. Nothing to happen in nowadays. I guess that's what peace means. How about you? Anything happening in your life? Yeah. I say, sounds tough. Well, good luck with whatever it is. <laughs> hey, what are you? Uh, aren't you a little too young to be in here? Well, I guess you can't stay. Just don't cause any trouble, all right? This is the worst bar. Are you kidding me? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Just assume the circle is Pepsi Cola dancing. All right, we're out of here. Given a cup of coffee, a signature for our own coffee during your break. My charm has increased. He dealt with housewives complaining that the pheromone coffee had no effect on them. Your courage has increased. <laughs> oh, Persona, you're a mean fucking game. I'm 11 minutes in, so I can say fuck. Oh yeah. Fuck. Today is show a day. There's no school. Click, click. The phone is ringing. Ring ring, ring ring, phone call. Yo Junpei here, you got some time? It's okay. Wanna do something today? Yeah, sure. Alright, I'll be waiting downstairs then. Junpei seems like, why the fuck did you call me, bro? Just come to my room like a man and talk to me. It would tell I, strip mall, Wakakasu restaurant. Ah, that was great, I can't eat anymore. Junpei seems satisfied. But man, you weighed a lot too. You ordered the same stuff as me, right? How in the world did you all fit inside your thin body? Junpei is looking at you impressed. Damn right I can pack it in. You know what I'm saying? So tell your friends. Remember how I told you the other day that there are guys that are interested in you? That's a Junpei? I can make jokes like that because I am a girl. You can't make those jokes after literally saying, look how much this woman can fit in her mouth. Come on. I bet you'd be shocked if they say how much they can eat. No, they wouldn't. Meh, like I care. You got a problem with that? Maybe I should eat less. Meh, meh, like I care. You got a point. Worrying about stuff like that will just ruin the good food you're eating. Also, you seem so happy that you're eating it makes me feel good watching. Uh, Junpei is laughing. I get where you're coming from this, Junpei. You have the tacticity of a billy goat. Meaning, you don't have very much. No one's back yet and we have school in the morning. We probably shouldn't go to Tartarus tonight. Yeah, you're right. I'm gonna hit the sack. Hit the road, sack. Don't you come back. I'm sorry for everyone hearing the clicking, by the way. There's nothing I can do about that. It's impossible for me to be in a comfortable position with my mic and not have the, com the controller near the mic at the same time. Let me tell ya. Troubles. Don't hurt nobody. Hey, say, hey, hey, you moved everybody with the body. Look what's real. Oh, there's nothing good on. No, I have to study. Because I'm one good girl. What the? That was ominous. You've decided to study. Your academics have been crazy. Bitchin'. Going to bed. Okay, now how many more days do I have? I have nine days. Let's see, today's lecture will cover the ancient tombs. I don't know, do you think any of this is relevant? I mean, I can make better tomb decorations than the ancients. Can't wait until we get to the Sengoku. Oh, I, I also can't wait till we get to Goku. It's so exciting. He shows up, everything's okay. Speaking of the Goku era, there, there was a general who was called the Warhawk on the battlefield. The Sengoku, the teacher keeps talking about Sengoku. Sun Goku, stay away. That's how the period came to be known as Sun Goku era. Huh? You want to hear more about ancient tombs? 
both of you insist. Study the Kintaro team in Nara because it'll be on the exam. He stayed up listening to the lecture. I'm hard to wake in my master bed. Going to find a way to open my eyes. And every. Hello, this is Elizabeth. <laughs> Please come to the velvet room. There's a matter we need to discuss. You may use the alternate entrance located in the Palo Wall. Halloweenia Mall. All you must do is find the door. I'll see you soon. I like the way Elizabeth looks, looks at me. Act oh, wait, there is a female romance in the female road. It's Elizabeth. Down that one. Spoilers for that. It's not, it's not really a route. You just kind of hang out with her a whole bunch. Oh, hey, old man. Yeah, everyone knows about the coffee. Shut your mouth. Old man. I am truly sorry to bother you, but I have a big favor to ask. I've been looking for someone with exceptional strength. If you don't mind, will you accept my request? Some of my missions will require you to escort me around, but... Of course, once each request is completed, I have a reward for you. I actually await your cooperation. Yes. Accept requests. Undertake a quest. Um, let's see. Yes. This one I can't do right now because it's a pain in the ass. Ooh, I can get you a sip of that muscle drink. And I already have this, so. Oh, I have to go in for the damn beetle shell. Okay. You seem to have completed a quest. Just a moment while I check. Well done, you have managed to retrieve the first old document in time. Have you already read it? It's quite interesting. If not, then it's definitely recommended you take a look. Please accept your reward. Some bead chains. Alright. Oh my. I've never tried a muscle drink before. Is it safe? Well, you have my thanks. I look forward to tasting it. Please accept your reward. I got a sweater. Is there anything else? Ah, uh, yes. Talk. Oh, I need to go back. I think. Go on a date with Elizabeth! Ah! I've been expecting you. Shall we be on our way? Palawinia Mall. Ah, yes. An intimate encounter with one of your world's rarities. I'm so glad you're talking, Elizabeth. I was this getting really tired. must be a fountain. Yes. It makes sport of water, well known to all to be the foundation of life. How wicked! <laughs> Uh, th here's the funny thing. This is so. This is like hilarious. I don't even need to say anything. It's rumored that its enchanting nature grants wishes to those who sacrifice a few coins. That's a superstition. Maybe so. Maybe so. Then I must try it for myself. Oh. Fortunately, I anticipated this and brought a good supply of coins. Two thousand of your five hundred yen coins, to be exact. I shall make an opening bid to the fountain spirit of one million yen. Elizabeth produced a bulging coin purse. The torrent of coins is like a waterfall. Here's the part that uh, you miss out by playing this version as opposed to the PS2 version. In the PS2 version, that animation won't end of her like dropping coins in the water. See, you just hear this over and over and over oh. again. So if you never press the button, she keeps doing it. I was so caught up in the excitement of tossing in coins that I hadn't given my wish any thought. This won't do. I shall give it more careful consideration before I return here in the near future. Hmm. hmm. What is this facility here? There are some stern-faced gentlemen inside. It's the Popo. And these photographs displayed so prominently. Most wanted. Reward. Am I correct in thinking of these as your version of my subjugation requests? Yes. Pretty much. You don't kill them. I don't know. Pretty what much. do they use as proof that the target has been subjugated? If they truly parallel my requests, do they require a piece of the body? My interest is piqued. Escapade. This edifice over here. It can't be. Is this... Club dancers dictated by the sway of one's inner passions. 
A subterranean garden of uninhibited spectacle. Oh, no. It's not closed for business now, is it? Such a pity. I had hoped to join in on the wild ritual. This is something else you miss out. Um, Elizabeth apparently unwilling to be dissuaded begin an elaborate dance. You actually get to see the dance in the PS2 version. Or the, um, yeah, the PS2 version. Join me, won't you? Try and keep up. Hell yeah. Unable to back down from Elizabeth's challenge, you decide to dance as well. My, such dynamic, flexible gyrations. I think I should give you a title, such as Master of the Dance. Persona 3, Dancing Moon Knight, currently in stores. Ooh, that was quite satisfying. Damn right. But I'm overwhelmed. Everything looks so new and inviting. Everywhere I look, something catches the eye. If you wouldn't mind, perhaps you could recommend our next activity? The answer is arcade. The arcade. This arcade? I have heard of it before. I recall it described as a playground where one sports with electric fairies in exchange for tokens. That's one way of describing what an arcade is. I have is. also heard that they contain games where one controls a bird to win prizes. I'm eager to see it. Ah, oh, excuse me. Would you mind waiting for a moment? I wasn't aware that there was a fountain on this side as well. Ah. Uh, the shame is that they show tarnaclinks like a waterfall. It's a shame that they show the shot, but they should have really tried hmm. to get her to show fountain. it. On the opposite side, I see. So this place is host to a trinity of fountain spirits. Elizabeth ran toward the fountain and started throwing coins in. Make it ring. Apologize for the wait. Let us continue. Let us. You spent time at the arcade with Elizabeth. Thank you for the invaluable experiences you've shared with me today. I consider this mission fully accomplished. This may sound forward, but Ooh. I'd like to accompany you again sometime. Anytime. You head back to the velvet room with Elizabeth. Thank you for answering my request. Well then, thank you for showing me around Palawinio Mall. The fountain, I still haven't made a decision on what to wish for. My master, regrettably, vetoed my wish to turn the Velvet Room into a club. And I was so set on it that thinking of something else is proving to be difficult. Oh, I finally came up with something. I wish to think of a wish. There, that wasn't so hard. Now, as a reward, I prepared something special. With this, you confuse Huepo. She is charming persona, combining the looks of a sweet girl with powerful abilities. Please accept your reward. A small chinogasm. <clears throat> is there anything else? Yes. Um, let me see, is it pine resin? Uh, this one. Yes. This one. And this one is like literally, it's the legendary sword in Thebol, so it's hard to actually find. Alright. I'm out of here. See you later. Ah. Parting is such sweet sorrow. Songs slaps, though. As the kids would say. I assume, I don't know what kids are saying. Let's see if Junpei wants to hang. Someone has to want to hang. Let me see, what does our current social incident look like? No! Yes. Two. Oh, we had the old couple. What is the old couple? Open all days but Mondays. Class clown. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Monday, 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 Monday Wednesday, Friday. That's how you doing, Stalker? He's so hot. Don't you think so, too? Man, he's so hot. Bro, I'm just standing here. Hey, I think that chick's checking me out. Oh, yeah, man, she's definitely checking me out. Who wouldn't? Look at your 3D model ass. Okay, let's see. Town up. Uh, that's 
Thursday, so we can definitely go to... Uh, do we even have Hurricane? Now that I think about it, I need to look again, because I forgot. You repent. I'm doing it. Oh, wait, no. I need to go back in, because Junpei, more friendship with Junpei means stronger Jack Frost. So guess what we doing? Hell yeah. Spend out with Junpei. Let's stop by somewhere. Junpei seems happy. Palomino Mall, Chagall Cafe. You came here with Junpei. Well, so this is what it's like inside this cafe. Oh, guys can't really come to places like this with each other. Juicy, Jun, Juice, eh? <laughs> Junpei seems a little embarrassed. Where do guy friends go? Uh, karaoke, Wild Duck Burger, and the Manga Cafe. Where bros hang out, reading manga. It sounds a lot lamer now that I actually say it out loud. Junpei laughs. Still, this is some damn good coffee. Tell that the guy who owns this place is really picky about the beans. Probably roast them all different using special waters for each type. What the hell? You got good taste. Heh, <laughs> I just really like coffee, that's all. Junpei seems proud of his coffee prowess. Oh yeah, what did you order, Pepsi? Uh hot cocoa. Oh hot cocoa, that's a girly drink. Despite what he said, Junpei seems happy for some reason. <laughs> Two of you chatted about different things for a while. Uh, by the way, are there any guys you're interested in? If you want, I'll totally help you out. It'd be fun being your cupid. Chupay laughs in a carefree manner. Oh yeah, what about Akihiko Senpai? You know girls are crazy about him. You better be careful that he doesn't play you. Wait, Akihiko sounds not the type of that's not that type of guy, so you don't need to worry. It's like the opposite. He'd be way too serious if you were in a relationship. It's true. Actually, why don't you try and get him seriously? A transfer student swoops in and steals the heart of the boy every girl wants. Don't you think that would be totally cool? Maybe something right out of the manga. Haha, <laughs> I forgot the haha. <laughs> Maybe I should give it a try then. Haha, <laughs> what do you mean by then? Well, if you're serious, feel free to talk to me about it. Junpei laughs. Junpei is like trying to be my wingman, and I'm here for it. It's not enough supportive men uh, for women who just want to be their buddy <laughs> in stuff like this. Uh, you understand you play a little more. I think it's fun. I don't know. That's how I feel. How do you feel about male to female relationships with no romance at all? I'm pro for it. Oh crud, is it already this late? Man, I really enjoy being around you for some reason. Well, let's head back. You and Jupe head back to the dorm together. Welcome back. Thank you. And with that, that is uh, Persona 3, so let's save it up here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like. If you're one of the people in the beginning, obviously if you've made it this far, you care enough about Persona 3, leave a damn like, please. Um, until next time, I think I'll do another one soonish. It's tough, because let me tell you, sometimes it's hard to record Persona. My foot fell asleep. You'll never understand the troubles of having your foot fall asleep. All right, everyone. Have a good day, and I'll see you next time, whenever that is. Later.